Hi, I'm Heather Nepal, forecaster at the National Weather Service in Miami. Say there's a hurricane approaching your area. You may be asking yourself, what kind of information should I be looking for? Well, you're probably familiar with this graphic, the cone of uncertainty, which tells you where the center of the storm is most likely to go. However, it doesn't say anything about potentially damaging impacts from storm surge, flooding, tornadoes, or strong winds that could affect areas far away from the center of the storm. So, where can you find this kind of information? Enter the Hurricane Threats and Impacts graphics. These graphics are produced by your local National Weather Service office, which give you a greater picture of the potential impacts. They can also help you in planning and preparing for the storm's hazards. For example, this graphic indicates the possible wind conditions that could reasonably occur at your location. The colors and the legend depict the threat level and potential impacts. In this case, locations depicted in purple face a potential for winds exceeding 110 miles per hour, while locations in red face a potential for winds exceeding 74 miles per hour, and so forth. Also, notice how the potential impacts may extend well beyond the corresponding cone graphic. In addition, you can access a pop-up window, showing the potential impact statements that go along with the threat level for the location of interest. Here we can see the storm surge inundation threat level and potential impacts. It's important to keep in mind that this map should not be used as a forecast of expected surge inundation, but to show the threat level and potential impacts. These HTI graphics are a useful tool, which can give you a better understanding of the threat and potential impacts from the different hazards of a tropical storm or hurricane threatening your area. So, you may be asking yourself, where can I find these graphics? Just click on the appropriate thumbnail at hurricanes.gov or visit your local National Weather Service office webpage at weather.gov. Click over your area, choose forecast, then choose tropical weather. And remember, it only takes one storm. So this hurricane season, being prepared is the key. Thanks for watching.